Hey everybody, welcome back to my world where no matter how old you get, you never need to grow up and you never need to stop being excited about Barbie and furry suits. That's right. We have got two more. These are the final two of the set of four of the newest Barbie cutie reveals. I got these on Amazon. I will put links down below. They will be affiliate links. If you use them, I will get a little bit of a commission. Thank you so much, which makes it possible for me to buy more dolls. So we saw the polar bear and the owl, and now we're going to take a look at the husky and the deer, which I'm calling a reindeer. So these are $24.99, and what they are essentially is a Barbie doll in a furry mascot suit. And so this is the winter themed, so these are for fall holiday season, and they have a deer, an owl, right? I skipped some, a deer, an owl, a husky, and a polar bear. So we did the polar bear and the owl in our previous video, and today we're gonna do the deer and the husky. Now I have to tell you a funny story. So this is the husky. Um, when I first uh, saw these, uh, one of my doll friends posted them on, on Instagram, uh, and we both interpreted the deer the same way from just like the sketchy promo picture we had we thought it was a giraffe now i would like to say in our defense that giraffes do have tiny little horn nubbins and but those horn nubbins don't look anything like this but as i said i'm trying to defend us but i thought it was funny that you know there was more than one person who was like oh they're doing a giraffe that's a it's like, why would a giraffe be in with the winter animals? Look, we had a thought process. So <laughs> this is the husky. And I love that they didn't go with super traditional husky colors here. We have this like, this baby blue, super fl flush, super plush fur. And it's got little strands of like tinselly fur mixed in, but not so much that it makes it feel not soft. It's just, there's, it's super soft. This is a super, super soft plush with just a hint. So it just like, looks like maybe they were running in the snow. You know, like when your dog runs in the snow and they've just got that little bit of a glisten to them from the snowflakes. That's what this looks like to me. And the face, uh, they tried to give it a little bit of a snout. It's hard. It's hard with some animals to make it, you know, to make this really look like a husky because huskies have, you know, pretty long snouts. It also would have been cool if they gave it blue eyes, but then that would be hard to do on, you know, with the embroidery and everything. And let's see, you have snowflakes in your eyes and cute little hearts, you blushes on your face. And then, you know, white over here. And then the paws... The hand paws, the plastic paws are white, and then the foot paws, foot paws, I don't know, they're black. And here you go, and then we've got the pointed ears. So this is the husky. So let's see who is inside the husky suit from Barbie Cutie Reveal. So I mean, it looks, it looks like a husky, you know, looks a little, but yeah, it works. Okay, here we go. Oh, we've got blue hair. <gasps> Oh, cool! Oh, that's really cool! So we've got a shaved side of the head and this really pretty turquoise hair. Now, they gave the doll blue eyes. Way to go! Way to go, Barbie! Beautiful! And I love the skin tone and the contrast with this hair and the eyes. Very, very nicely done. Bravo, bravo, brava. I don't know who the designer was. Um, so let's get the paws off. So these are really cool because uh, these feet are so big that they can stand on their own without a stand when they're in their 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 fursonas here and uh they're just really fun i mean there's so much imaginative play that can be done i mean you can switch these the the fur costumes around to different dolls um you can't get them over a rainbow high head or anything because they are but so it needs to be a barbie sized head doll but uh you know it'll fit any of your barbies so that's super cool 
and uh, you can just have fun. You can mix and match the fur pieces, the different outfit pieces. The dolls are articulated more so than a Barbie fashionista, so they are articulated at the elbow and the knee. Uh, but and then their heads are very articulated, so they're just missing like uh, you know ankle and hand articulation and waist articulation. But but still got quite a few points of articulation that makes them fun to photograph. So let me get the the furry pajama pants off here. And so she's got light blue, sort of uh, turquoisey, aquamarine, ocean blue. Love the hair. Love this hair. Wow. So the hair is always a little messy coming out because it's all, you know, bunched up under the, uh, the, the hood there, the, the head. But that's very pretty hair. I love this color. Ooh, very pretty. Okay, so now there is a surprise-ish element. They put their outfits in surprise bags, but I mean, if you look at the box, you know what it is, but I'm trying not to look at the box. So this is her comb brush, and it has the little sponge built in to do the color change with the ice water. And then she also has her little husky ears headband. So they all get a headband to make them look like their, 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 their fur personality. Oh, and she's got little blue cowboy boots interesting now am i missing am i missing something i think she should have a skirt yeah okay like wait i'm missing stuff hello all right it's like she should have more stuff where's her pet where's her skirt so this is her skirt oh this is pretty this has got like a tie-dye stone wash kind of look on it very cool very very cool and then let's see what her pet is i'm assuming her pet is a little husky oh look at it look at it look at the little ears look at the little face i love siberian huskies i wanted one as a kid which is completely impractical by the way because we did not we didn't have a yard big enough there nobody was going to take that dog for a walk having a dog was not in the cards we had uh we had some outdoor cats that we adopted and that was that was the beginning of the cat uh the whole cat thing with my brother buddy and i so here she is in her skirt and let's put on her cowboy boots so this is just a cool look that you can sort of mix and match with other barbie stuff you have cowboy boots tank top like ex you know like yoga top Ugh. stone wash skirt cool shaved head i'm a cool chick yeah all right now let's take cool chick's jacket and turn it inside out yes because that is the other big surprise is that their fursuit jackets turn into jackets that they can wear um that have different patterns on the inside so let's get that turned inside out here man makes me want to be cold but then when it's cold out what do i do i complain that it's cold because i'm an old person <laughs> i'm a person people are always complaining so this is cool so this has that traditional sort of forest motif on it and it almost looks a little bit flannel with the lighter and the darker i kind of like that I love flannel. Love, love, love flannel shirts. I don't wear them because they don't look good on me. But I do love a flannel shirt on a man. So, obviously, supernatural. Love me a flannel shirt. Or a trench coat. One or the other. Okay, there we go. Yay! So, alright. So this is a pretty saucy outfit. You know what this reminds me of, for no particular reason whatsoever, is in the movie Love Actually when uh, Colin goes to Wisconsin and he meets the really hot girls in the typical American bar. And they are kind of dressed like for freezing cold weather, but in mini skirts with cowboy boots and lots of skin underneath their, their warm, you know, their super warm jackets. It's just given me that vibe. Don't know why. Okay, let's get your little, your little husky ears on here. There we go. All right. Okay, now let's put the ice water on her face and see what the makeup looks like. So I'm dipping the comb into a glass of ice water to get the sponge icy cold. And then we'll do this. Oh gosh, it's like when she only did one eye. She's like, I was trying something. I just did the one eye. Okay, excuse me. 
I need to just dunk. Go bob for apples for me. There we go. Oh, yeah. Okay, that is really cool for a husky themed doll to have like such a bold eyeliner like that. I would have liked like maybe a different lip, but I'm surprised she doesn't have any markings on her face though. She just has like a little bit on her cheeks. Wait, let me, am I imagining that she's got little marks on her face? Wait, is it on the side of her head? <laughs> nope, 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 nothing going on there. It looks like she's got like little white, like a little constellation of white marks. Uh, oh, look, my nails match her face. But it's really hard to see. It's nothing striking, but I do like the eyes. Would have liked a darker lip because it does make her look very intense. And I mean, I don't want her to have blue lips, but because you know, I didn't like the blue lips but I'm trying to get her headband on and her hair is wet. My hand is slippery. It's not working out. It's just not working out, people. Here we go. So there she is. I don't know. <laughs> Alrighty, now on to the deer. Yes, that's what we've been waiting for. Yes, this one I, I'm hoping, I was expecting it to be the highlight. So far, the polar bear has really been my runaway favorite so far. I mean, there's only four of them, so it's not like a big, you know, decision to make, but I, I expected, I expected to like the husky and the owl more than I did. So I'm a little disappointed, but here we go. So this is the deer, the reindeer, deer, the not a giraffe. That's what this is. I am not a giraffe. Okay. And there's all your surprise things. Ooh. Okay. So this is where the budget went. So we've got gold, gold antlers here. Cute little gold antlers. They'll, they'll stand up straight eventually. Look at that face. Look at it. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. So, so cute. With the antlers and the little heart-shaped blush and the little nose and the little snowflakes in the eyes and the eyelashes very cute and then we've got all the spots so it's a baby it's a baby reindeer and then the hooves are gold very very fancy and it's a beautiful brown like fawn brown color like a tiny bit of orange in it but not a lot not like super tacky looking um oh this is so cute i love it look at how cute that is Definitely can like I put them all back in their fursuit and display them that way. Um, uh, so cute. Oh, this is going to be a Christmas decoration. Definitely a Christmas decoration. You and the polar bear can hang out, but the polar bear needs to be like with a with a Coca-Cola Santa of some kind. OK, here we go. Let's take off the head and see who's inside. Oh, pink. I did not think this was going to be pink. Interesting. I thought this would be a redhead. Just no particular reason. Really pretty classic Barbie sculpt. I'm not sure what the name is, but this is a pretty classic face. And all right, let's get your jacket off. So she's got two tone pink hair. It's sort of a bubblegum pink and then a darker pink. So that's cute. Kids love pink and blue hair. So they definitely, they nailed it on that. And she's got the gold undergarments. And it's interesting, her, her, her jammies are wide leg, you know, to go over those big gold hooves. They've even put horseshoes on them. Do you put horseshoes on deer hooves, I wonder? I don't know. Okay, let's set this aside. Wait, I need to move the husky. You know, I've got like a pile of fur stuff going on over here. All right, so this is her pet, which is a little baby deer. Oh, oh, oh. Okay, worth it for this, okay? Look how cute is this baby reindeer? How cute is that? Oh my gosh. Oh yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, I'm digging it. And then these are her antlers. Oh, she got some good antlers. What was that movie with the, and then she gets a pink comb with 
the sponge on the back and that. Oh, 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 um, it's not fresh air. What is that movie with animals that live outside? Duh. And the one of them gets, um, oh, how cute. I just realized this. She's got little flowers, a little flowers on her antler crown. They put all the budget into this. What is it? Something about being outside. The one, the one animal in the movie, one of them's a bear and then one of them is a deer who is trying to grow his antlers and then he finally grows this like incredible rack of antlers and then one of them breaks on his wedding day. What is that movie? Mm. Look at this. This is unexpected. Very pretty, almost a cherry blossom sort of theme on this skirt with some gold accents. Really did not expect that. I am loving this. Definitely a keeper. And then we've got, ah, we've got brown Santa boots. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Oh, these are so cool. They're like super high riding boots with Santa cuffs on them. Very well played, Barbie. Well played indeed. Okay, so let's put this on her. I love this skirt. I would like a dress with this pattern on it. Look at how pretty that is. It's such a beautiful color, pink. It's like a coral pink. And then it's got the white and a little bit of gold. It's like a warm pink. I love it. Right. Let's look what's inside <laughs> the reindeer's jacket. Ta-da! Oh, wow! I really, see, I tried really hard not to look at the pictures so that I could be surprised, and I did not see it going in this direction. Kudos, kudos for just totally going outside the theme. Way to go, Barbie. This is a win. Definitely a win in my book. Me taking this taking this down a pink road, like I just thought we were going pink with the hair, but nope. We're just all in, going all in on pink here. Okay, so let's just get the jacket on. Here, bend your arm. Hey, in good news, my mom can now bend the broken arm. Oh, ho, yay! There we go. Um, yeah, it only took three months for her to be able to bend her broken arm again. There we go. Okay, so I don't love the polka dot <laughs> jacket with the skirt, really. But, I mean, I don't know. Mm. Let me put her, let me put her antlers on. I'm trying to, rec I mean, like, I don't know. I really wanted to love it. But I almost think I'm going to turn it back to the other side and have her wear the jacket with the deer spots with the skirt, maybe. I don't know. And there she is with her antlers. Now the antlers are super pretty, but the flowers almost get lost because they're the exact same color as her hair. And now let's get her makeup to come out and play. So I'm going to dip the spongy part of the comb in here and let's see what happens. Now this was an opportunity, such a missed opportunity here. All of the previous Barbie cutie reveals, who remembers what happened to their noses? when you did this. This is the one time that that would have been a good idea. Oh my gosh. And she's just got like a little flower thing next to her eye. Is it both eyes or is it just one eye? Here, let me just, Joan Crawford here. Nope, it's both eyes. It's a little flower thing going on there. I mean, I like the lip color and I, I like how it all how it all comes together on her face. Um, I think this is the best makeup of the four, honestly. I just, I really wanted to like, I mean, the skirt gave me so much hope, but it just, it doesn't, it doesn't. Okay. All right, so let's just, let's just get our little reindeer friend to wake up in the water and, I'm awake! I'm awake! I'm ready to lead Santa and his sleigh! Yay! Woo! Yeah. Well, really, honestly, I really thought this was going to be my favorite right up until I put on the jacket. Um, she definitely looks, 
dangerous. Definitely a dangerous look in those eyes. Uh, she looks very sweet and cute and just a little confused about what color skirt to wear with a uh, pink and white polka dot situation. And like the brown boots are just sort of, mm, I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, well, these are still really, really cute. I mean, I'm being super overcritical here. I realize that entirely. Uh, but I would love to know what you think, so please tell me in the comments down below. And if you've seen both videos, let me know which of the four dolls is your favorite. I'm still, I'm, I'm still, I'm really, really digging the way this outfit comes together, honestly. But, I mean, I do love the reindeer just, it just doesn't come together as much as I wanted it to. So anyway, let me know what you think. Can't wait to hear from you and I will see you again real soon. Thank you for watching. Bye.